Okay, and then we're going to draw the uh, the lunar landing module on the moon. So we're going to need pens, we're going to need pencils, we're going to need an eraser, and uh, I've got one of these Mars Lumograph pencils that uh, Stadler sent me to try. I'm going to try the 6B, which is really nice and soft. I like drawing with very soft things. Right, now the, uh, the you kind of want a, it's kind of a circle and a square is basically how the whole thing starts off. And in the middle, of the circle you've got this kind of uh, I don't know it's, it, 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 it's, it's narrow at the top and wider at the bottom okay and then you want eyebrows <laughs> yes the lunar module had eyebrows and I, I think that's what gave it its character um, it always looks so sad the lunar module I think and uh, hang on I'm just um, just checking where I'm going now so this this now wants to come kind of across to the, so use that circle to kind of draw, actually that comes a bit more closely to the, the side and then you can, so it's not really a circle, it's a mm, oh, I do this. It's kind of an octagon isn't it, something like that and there will be the door, uh, now on the side like we had in the command module if you've done that video you have these little thruster um, motors on the sides like that I don't know what this thing is on the top. It looks like a street lamp. I don't, it can't be that simple. And then there's a, a a thing here. There's a kind of a radio, you know, antennae kind of thing. Okay, and that's basically the. Oh yeah, and then there are kind of tanks around the back, uh, which are the kind of fuel tanks, I suppose. And they're kind of strange geodesic kind of shape. Right, that will fit into kind of two shapes. You're going to get a kind of a map thing down there uh, now from fr from this square draw bits out like that and then the legs will come down like that uh, here you've got the steps coming down but you've also got uh, a leg underneath it now these ones here there's a, there's a join here from the bottom up to there and there and kind of there as well so that will kind of go to there and there. Uh, how does that look? I think we're ready to, to do the ink. Where are the pens? Ah! Right, okay. <laughs> These are Mars Lumograph pens, which uh, I'm going to use the, the fine one, um, which are permanent, which means I can rub it out really quickly at the top. Oh, I just noticed it doesn't all quite fit in um, that well, does it? So, um, do you want a spaceman as well? Um, there. He's about, about that height standing up, okay. And we'll put his feet like that, and that will do. <laughs> uh, where am I going to start? I'm going to start right up at the top with, with the street light. I'm going to call it a street light, I have no idea what it is. Right, draw that line right down there, and then, uh, and then this part here is the door. Uh, now this is the eyebrow like that which covers um, over the window. So this is where you have what you had an astronaut behind each one as they were coming into land um, and you can shade that in so they were kind of that's where they stand. There's no seats I don't think. Uh, there's no, no room, there's no time for sitting down. Um, so the that kind of has a little wiggle at the bottom there as well like that uh, and you've got that bit there holding this kind of antennae like that and then there's a another antennae up there now you've got these little gimbals on the side like that gimbals they're not gimbals I don't know why I keep calling them gimbals they're little thrusters which um, propel the craft left and right and yaw and pitch and up and down and things like that and you can have another one like that there we go good round the back we have those um, the kind of geodesic structures they look like which are the petrol tanks like petrol <laughs> I'm not sure what they use I bet it wasn't petrol uh, right this is the main body let's draw the the ladder first because that's kind of the nearest thing to you there's the ladder going across like that 
and then behind it will be the body of the this leg here which is going to look like that and I think you've probably got bits going back something like that something like that something like that anyway this will come down there that will come across that will come down. just have that slightly up there uh, let's put the spaceman in and and he's going thumbs up and giving you a wave. I don't know if they're suits. They would actually be able to do that. <laughs> he looks more like a firefighter, doesn't he, really? Uh, you know, one of those things that, as he goes in like Red Adair, going into one of those oil fires or something. Those great big backpacks that they carry. Okay, um, there's a kind of a ball joint there. And probably one there as well. So that's convenient. We've hidden most of the, 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 the that landing thing behind there. So I put a ball joint there and a ball joint there. And there's probably one there as well. Bring that down all the way there. And like that. And then here, there's a little thing with it. United States. And that's looking pretty good. Let's uh, so we draw some moon in the background, and I think we probably ought to have. Uh, is that going to? There's tis on there. The tis still on the page. Yeah. Uh, oh, can you see the sun coming in through the trees? Uh, stars and stripes, and a few stars up in the sky. Like that. How are we doing for time? I think we're doing okay. Um, now, because it's a permanent pen, I know that I can rub out all these pencil lines and uh, and it's not going to streak the ink but if you uh, if you press too hard you're probably not going to be able to rub out the lines and if they always make sure that the ink is dry I quite often use um, a hairdryer just to make sure oh I made this drawing too big for the camera but never mind you get the idea don't you so uh, there we are the lunar landing module <laughs> And <laughs> what are we going to do? Uh, keep coming back to uh, the Shoe Rainer Drawing School on YouTube and come to www.shoe-tube.com where you can see all these videos uh, get through uh, on, on school whiteboards and things like that. I'm on TeacherTube as well, teachertube.com. And uh, just keep coming back. I'll be doing more videos as, as time goes on. I'll probably do quite a few space things over summer because of um, the, 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 the British um, reading scheme in libraries is all about space this year. So uh, don't be surprised if I do lots of space things. OK, uh, space requests. How about that? And uh, d do a video response. Uh, subscribe. You get a chance of winning one of my books, a signed copy of one of my books. Uh, video response on YouTube. And uh, subscribe to me on YouTube. OK, take care. See you next time. Bye.